Hello, and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Odyssey. This is part five, and let's get to it. After we stopped last stream, I leveled up a bit. Uh, so I'm going to be changing some stuff around. I'm going to be doing the, like, main missions and exclamation point missions, pretty much. Those are the main quests. And hunting the cult, the cult of Cosmos while I'm streaming. But anything else, uh, like just leveling up for, to, uh, by getting, oh, I don't know, all the submissions, that I'll do off screen so as not to like detract too much from the experience. I didn't know, know what to consider, what exactly to consider, uh, let's see, what do we have in quests so far? Okay, so, go meet with Herodotus. I didn't know what to consider uh, main quests, and I thought that like ones that weren't necessarily tied to the main storyline weren't main, even if they had exclamation points on them. And I did two of them. The first one I did seemed a little bit important to the storyline. It was about uh, a woman who was sickly ill, but she would always provide false information. Uh, as a Pythia, uh, it's like a false mysticism, and she may have been the one to provide false information about the about Alexius. She doesn't clearly say, but she did apologize for it, and she said that the group that had her do it was the Cult of Cosmos. So that was a little important to the storyline. The second one, not so much, because the second mission uh, was basically uh, some middle-aged lady asking me to get a basically an ancient form of Viagra for her husband to spice up the, the bedroom life. So yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. So I'm like gonna be doing any explanation point missions on. The screen, the stream, or YouTube, however you want to see it, whoever's watching it, whatever time. Anytime I'm like grinding or anything like that, I'll just do that off screen. Now, aside from that, I, did gain, I gained some things. I'm not going to worry about the ammo. I'm just going to go through. Uh, let's see, because now we've got cultist menu, and some of them have already popped up. These are the guys that, like, have already died. And some are pretty in pretty close areas. And seem high enough level to, like, actually get them. And the cool thing is that on the map, they show up as... Where's one of them? Oh, there's another exclamation point. Daughters of Artemis. Not that one. Anyway. So they come up as little Medusa heads, like this one here. I'm actually at a pretty good level to get that one. So first let's go over to where... Herodotus is located. Atreus the Aid. Seems pretty cool. Definitely not going to try to attack him. Dante on a mercenary. I'm not going for that one. Very steep um, pathway. Oh, we're going to Thermopylae. Yeah. 
You can do it, Bobos. Big Mac ain't got nothing on you. Okay, is there actually a way to get down to that path? Out of the way. I'm with him. Forward. Get my helmet. Come on, don't walk in the middle of the road. Bubbles, that time I blame you. Okay, now there's just one guy here. Don't run into him. Don't. That's right, Bubbles. Nice pace. Let them walk the path. That's a good boy. Good. Okay, ignore the bear. Oh, that big grizzly bear. So, well, so you actually know where you're going. So we just don't go down this way to go up around here. Oh, I haven't used that one yet. Okay, you can take us to the sink point. been born without iPhones. And again, they probably didn't know what an iPhone was. We found different ways to pass the time. Okay, I do love the scenery. Lalia. Place for the forest sing. La li la. La li la li la. La li la li la. Oh, you can hear the merc. Malice. Wildlands of the North. Malice. It's got this question. I'm sure it questions people very humanely. Another bear. Now, when I found out about Malice, 
is that there were three tribes in it, the Parlians, the Hyrians, and the Trachians. And in 426, the Spartans founded Heraclea and Trachis. What happened was the Trachians had suffered in a war with the Oteans, and the different areas would be like, let's see. Is right here, so okay. I'm guessing he's taking me down here to get there. So, Trachians were like around here, you know, Tans were right next to them. They were also causing some issues with the with another region called Doris. Yeah, the uh, and so they looked for to Athens for security, or well, they were going to choose Athens for security, but they didn't want to get caught up in their empire. We asked the Spartans for security since so they're closer and they had a better reputation for warfare. The Spartans agreed as long as that they could establish a colony on Trachis, which they called Heraclea on Trachis. And they did. And from day one, all the other tribes bordering uh, Heraclea uh, were just hostile to it because they were allies of Athens, and it was a Spartan colony. And by and in oh, uh -oh. Yeah. Okay, they're not gonna leave going up this one. Uh. Oh and there's a bear! Zenes the Fool. Let's make Zenos the Fool. Helios the Weak. Tribes, including the Malians, defeated defeated the Heracleans, killed the Spartan commander, and just destroyed the city. So sad time for Heraclea during this war, where Spartan established a colony, but then lost it to uh, the rest of the tribes in the region. Come on. <laughs> Is also, as you as you probably noticed, the same place where Thrum Ampelite happened. Thermopylae. They say you can't walk this battlefield without getting blood on your toes. And why are you here? one of those brave Spartans perished. Their voices were silenced that day, but their story will be sung for an eternity. You didn't bring me here to talk about dead Spartans. What's on your mind, Herodotus? The Battle of Thermopylae still echoes in our hearts. 
But to stand here is to feel it in your bones. There's nothing here but ghosts. My concerns are with the living. Hold out your spear. My spear? What for? I need to know something. You are obsessed with the spear, dude. Oh. <laughs> Talk about a badass. Okay, it wasn't Xerxes, but wow. Sparta's allies. The Spartans weren't alone in facing Xerxes and his hordes. Many from across the Greek world were armed and ready to fight alongside Leonidas and his 300. But when the mighty king looked into their eyes and saw fear, he sent them home. That sounds like madness, not bravery. It was foretold by the Pythia that Sparta would lose either its freedom or its king to the Persians. Leonidas made his choice. Yeah, that's what many people don't uh, understand with stuff like 300 is that there were 300 Spartans, yes, but there were like, I think the number was 27,000 other Greeks. The Athenians were assisting by sea, but many Peloponnesian Greeks were aiding on land, aiding the Spartans. What happened to Leonidas after the battle? Xerxes was famous for honoring warriors who fought valiantly against the Persians. But Leonidas infuriated him so much, he cut off his head and impaled it on a pike. A bloody battle ensued, and his remains were reclaimed by the Spartans and buried here. Now, however, he rests where he belongs. In Sparta. What happened to the traitor, Ephialtes? King Xerxes paid him well, but treachery breeds treachery. A contract was put on his head, and he died as he lived. A coward. Yeah, you really can't trust traitors. Many other traitors have, like, in history, have gone under the same scrutiny, like Benedict Arnold betrayed the Americans to the, to the British. 
and even when he like served in like in Britain, no one would trust him because he was a traitor. You knew this would happen. I didn't know, but I did suspect. There is a place I convinced myself was a dream. Until now. A peculiar structure on the island of Andros. Mysterious shapes carved in stone. Like nothing I've ever seen. You want to sail to Andros so you can show me shapes? In my travels, I heard whispers of an ancient civilization. A people who came before. Your spear and that place are connected. You mentioned a people that came before. Who were they? They were not gods, but they lived far longer than any mortal, and were far more intelligent. I've seen carvings in caves, strange symbols that suggest it was this ancient civilization that created humankind, and provided them with fire. But Zeus blamed Prometheus. Yes. Well, perhaps his eagle has been feasting on the wrong liver. The spear awakened to you, Herodotus. I trust you. You understand. I will do everything in my power to help you find your mother. I promise. But first, we must sail to the island of Andros. I'll meet you at my ship. Will you be traveling with us? Only for a short trip. Okay, where's Andros? Okay, the structure is located on Andros. It is the western part of the abandoned forest. Used to protect the entrance. Lemnos, Lesbos, Chios. Oh, there's Andros. Okay. Oh, and there's somebody there as well that we can kill. Okay, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. I Andros is another region I don't know. <laughs> I know little to nothing about. Uh, and in this case, I know nothing about it. It. From Lo from Phokis to Malis to Andros. Can you please take us in a region where I have business to attend to? That's a little bit more popular. Than is helping before. me well, find my mother. Seeking help from the gods has put Irodotos on your path, just like they put you on mine. They work in ways beyond our comprehension, and all we can do is follow their lead. You could be right. Irodotos and I share enemies too. Like in Pinor. He is... was... part of a very powerful group called the Cult of Cosmos that controls the Greek world through the Oracle. Control the Oracle? Impossible! Apollo would not allow that! Now they're looking for my mother. I need to find her before they do. And I believe they will hurt others who oppose their views along the way. By Hermes! The Oracle lost to corruption and now this cult? Do we know who leads them? I don't know for sure, but I think it might be my brother. Your brother? By Zeus, your life is complicated! Tell yeah, me. Way of it. But don't you worry! This cult of Cosmos now has three new enemies! And one of them fights like Athena and shits thunder like Zeus! We'll bring the wrath of the gods down upon them! Is he always this positive? Always. That's why I like him. Poseidon, carry us to Athens! First, we need to go to Andros. To Andros, then! We're going to have to do some upgrades to my oh, yeah. ship if we're sailing into war. What do you mean? Well, she's old, and perhaps not in the best condition. You couldn't have said this before we set sail? Where in Poseidon's name are we going to get the supplies? My father taught me that the sea takes, and we must do the same. Fortunately, there are plenty of pirate ships in these waters that we can and take from. What are we waiting 
pick for? Let's hunt some violence! your thumbs get after you button mashed a whole bunch. Got that a bit with playing Metroid Dread. Not comfortable with some lasers and missiles and stuff. Ooh, shark! Yes! 
yeah, is. some stuff. Okay, I can't upgrade it now. That's right about pirates. Ready for attack! I don't think the crew can handle much more. They are going to hit us! More crew on deck! Go! I'm gonna get out of here. Backwards. No. Look there! Help it! No. I want to check you guys first, but. Stop it. Looks like we're out of danger. For now. We're still in the middle of a health and war. Which is not the best time period to be in. Just ask the Pompeians. Oh wait, you can't. They're all pulled off by Sparta. That's okay, you can ask the aliens. Oh wait, you can't. They were killed off by the War sucks. Do you like this water though? You can tempo that side. In the middle of the ocean? Ooh. That happens. Right, and push it up. Out of there. It's your beer. So Athens is on the other side. Yo show. You look pretty well. way around the seas, okay? Impressive. It's an art, my friend. My father used to say, when Nix blinds you, seek he got. Your father was a man of the sea, what? No, he was a potter. But he was a man who always saw light in the darkest of places. Then you take after your father. We all do, whether we like it or not. The Bay of Marathon is here. Marathon? You know, the battle where a handful of Athenians pushed back the first Persian invasion. Mm. The great Themistocles. Crew to battle station! Spears now! Burn them Oh, cool. Really? Fire spears. How you doing? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, 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 
god. Head yet, and it's like, okay, it's, it's gone. It's a treasure. No! We've stolen the loot that we stole from, our, from that other ship. And now it's just gonna go. Oh crap. Was here. Come on, they were right here. Oh my goodness. Oh wait. There he is. There we go. Or she, Camara. Get 
Sure. Something that's part lion, part goat, and part snake. Part hawk or eagle as well. Bringer, find and kill Derops? What? It's way above my level. Oh crap. Piggies. Big bad wolf gonna surprise me as well. Maybe maybe bring that bear along. Okay, let's go.
Perfect. Discover locations you to be at. Try this one first. I can put photos. Photos away! Good boy. You cross the ocean to get to me. I can always count on you.
없는데. 
Some recognize the power we bear and want it only for themselves. They will try to take it from us. I won't let them. I know. You're a warrior. If we keep moving forward, always moving forward, we're untouchable. Storms coming in. Then maybe we should move forward now. <laughs> this to someone like Marcos. Will it make us money? Something's glowing over there. Something is... Things are glowing everywhere. Oh, ooh. Your shape. The Forge! I knew I let you stay in the Animus too long. Your vitals are crashing! You don't understand. This confirms it. Cassandra didn't just have Isu technology. She had the means to improve it. Imagine how powerful the staff could be. I admit, that could be an incredible find. But right now, I'm the doctor, and I take care of you. Now get some rest before you go back to Cassandra. Yeah, I'm not gonna be uh, paying to her, so. If you insist, but only because I've got work to do on the outside. Please, just clear your head. The last thing we need is a cell leader suffering from the bleeding effect and spearing us because we're Hittites or Thracians. I won't. The Thracians throw great parties. Don't forget, we're a team. We'll back you up until you're finished your investigation. I know. Kyoshi secured the loft yesterday and he's keeping an eye out. Elena's on call doing historical research. And I'm here to talk if you're feeling any confusion from the Animus. Always the therapist. So, Doctor, how do you feel now that we're closer than ever to the staff? I believe this staff is important. But the Templars and Assassins have found staves of Eden before. Nikolai Tesla blew one up in Russia, if I remember correctly. This is different. If what I saw in Egypt is true, this staff doesn't control minds. It controls physics. Time. Imagine rewriting the rules of the universe. The spear you found is right here, and it's not doing anything. The spear is attached to a bloodline. Leonidas, Cassandra, and Themos, I mean, Alexios, they were intimately connected to it. Are you sure you can use the staff of Hermes, then? No. But if the Templars get it, they won't stop until they find someone who can. So, what do you think of my new Animus? You mean, our new Animus? 
That's Abstergo equipment. Which I've modified to within a millimeter of its digital life. It's an Animus console prototype, Brahman variant, with the IO capacities pushed to their max. Ultra portable with more calculating power than NASA and CERN combined. Hmm. I'll go stretch my legs. Too bad we don't have access to the Abstergo gym anymore, huh? Membership costs too much. As far as I know, I think it's that she's no longer with Abstergo. Oh! Eagles are fine and all, but a pet monkey would be even cooler. <laughs> well, I think eagles are a bit better than a pet monkey. I seem to remember, uh, well, technically with a chimpanzee, but they still be mischievous. What? Better than a monkey and an eagle. What? A rabbit. Heck, it's better than a guard dog. I mean, a guard dog will bark at you. Heck, it'll even bark, bite, bite you, or bite its opponents. But how do you think a person's going to react to a ra rabbit screaming, running at it with a blunt object? Just, ah! The center of the universe, circa 400 BCE. I should check my email. Of course. Okay, I'm not... Well, let's just quickly go through this. I'm not going to wait too much time. Ahead. Just look around. Fascinating. Layla, can you believe we're meeting Herodotus himself? I can. He sure does talk a lot. Is there anything I can help you with? So does what I'm seeing as Cassandra match your research? I had to tweak the Animus to use what we have of the book as reference. That book is a lost work by Herodotus. He basically invented the concept of recording history. Mm -hmm. And other figures are matching up too. Cleon, Pericles. The chance to see the past firsthand is why I joined the Assassins. Most people would talk about justice or leaping across rooftops, but history is cool too. I've loved history since my grandpa told me stories about his grandpa back in Ireland. He was an adventurer and sailor. So I'm continuing the family tradition. I feel so lucky. You make your own luck, remember? Why do people keep telling me that? I remember them mentioning Pericles, but I didn't hear them mention Cleon. So I've met Herodotus, but I don't know much about him. He's brilliant. His histories are considered the foremost textbook of classical Greece. People have made their careers analyzing his words for some new perspective. To see him in his own world, walking in the polis, and... Sorry, but he's kind of a hero of mine. You can fangirl all you want. Yay! <laughs> I'll leave you to your work. If you need anything, just let me know. Still surprised that Thucydides is in this. I wonder if the Fry Twins would still recognize London. A rooftop's still a rooftop. How's it going out there? Well, no threats in view. I'm glad we could work together again. I believe our working methods are compatible. Of course, I'll return to the Animus, then follow the trail Irodotos left to find the staff. But there's so many possibilities, so many choices. There's no way to know which ones are right. You used to run part of the Japanese Brotherhood. What would you do? Take things one step at a time, observe their act, or kill everyone and search their pockets for answers. You decide. Are you still upset about our last run-in with Abstergo? I'm sorry, I didn't realize those hills in Quebec were so steep. But hey, you and your Yakuza reflexes saved us! Sorry, ex-Yakuza. We're all alive and our injuries have healed. That's what matters. Thanks for watching our backs, Kiyoshi. I'll leave you to your work. I'll report in if Abstergo drops by.
looks third echelon. Or was it fourth? <laughs> Too bad we had to leave before we could drink some more caribou. Caribou. Can I not talk to you? Are you sure you want to go back into the Animus right now? I get the impression you'll be there a long time. Yeah, yes, kind of the idea. I'm ready to go back to Cassandra. All right, I'll be watching your back. Ooh. Oh, cool. The shaft's not My broken. Is stronger now. The cult won't stand a chance. Upgrade the spear of Leonidas here at the forge of Hephaestus during the artifact fragment. Using the artifact fragments, upgrading it increases your adrenaline and unlocks more powerful abilities. Collect artifact fragments from de defeated members of the Cult of Cosmos. Review the quest menu to track progress toward more spear upgrades. Sweet. Uh, okay, wait. What happened? Uh, Alright, I can upgrade the ship now. Let's see, let's even this out a bit, so... Spears up. Bring my arrows up. And looks like that's all I can do. I can bounce things out. Got more exclamation points. Sage is not as wise. Sage is involved in the ship. Matt's silver thing. There's information about the cultist in an Attica silver mine. Okay. Well, Herodotus will be happy. It's clear someone was here far before we were. Yeah, but apparently he stopped writing history. Did Leonidas know this place existed? down here. You're not hard to track. Did you come alone? Are you all right? <laughs> Alexios, you're alive. Don't touch me. <laughs> come on, little brother. You have to tell me everything. What's happened to you? I don't have to tell you anything. I don't know you. Well, I know you. It doesn't matter. There's more important things to argue about. You're right. Like that stunt you pulled with the artifact. It got my attention, if that's what you wanted. What? The artifact showed the truth. We're family. And we made it out of Sparta alive. 
Yes, it did show the truth. It confirmed what I always knew. You threw me off a fucking mountain! <laughs> if that's what you think, Alexios, you must have hit your head on the way down. I've heard this story, and not from a liar like you. And never call me Alexios. Right. Demos. Now him, I don't know. He's a demigod. Worshipped and feared by the cult and all the Greek world. Then why do the cult's bidding? Have you been paying attention? They're following my lead. Then make a choice on your own. Help find our mother. I'm not interested in reunion. I just want to know what you think you're doing. Same thing as your cult. Looking for Mirini, our mother. They don't need her. Your cultists think differently. She's their next target. If they ever pursued her, it would be to kill her. But if you don't know where she is, that means she abandoned you too. How sad. Even if we were abandoned, we survived. We can go back to the way things were if we can find her. The cult has no interest in sentimentality or family. Its only aim is control. If it's true they're after us, tell them they'll never find Nikolaos. He's off the map. Trust me, I've searched myself. If I could find you, the other long-lost child of Nikolaos, then I can find him. And when I do, he'll wish he was thrown off that mountain. I don't care what you think. I'll find Mirini. Do the right thing. Come with me. What? We could find her. Together. You could help me. <laughs> oh, you think friendship is the answer? Running around like lost <laughs> children looking for dear mother. You're so weak. It's responsibility, not weakness. I won't abandon the whole family just for spite. Responsibility? Get off your high horse! The cult has a plan, and it won't be interrupted by the likes of you. Taking your own mother isn't enough for them? We're not abductors. We're political. Those who don't stand with us stand against us, and they pay for that mistake. Like me. Like you. I heard you're planning a trip to Athens. When you go, tell Pericles and his elitist scum they're next. The cult let Mirini live. They let Nikolaos live. Why kill them now? Because you live. You brought this on her and yourself. The cult is powerful, but they're mortals. I have the blood of gods, so they think you do too. But they'll see how wrong they are. I'm going after the cult, you know. You've seen our numbers. You've seen what I can do. And you still think you stand a chance? Try me. So having guts runs in the family, does it? <laughs> you claim we have the same blood. So let's see what you can do. We still found each other, brother. Oh. I told you not to touch me. Demos! <sighs> Malaka. Herodotus won't believe this. I have to tell him what happened. Hey, 
have I got a story for you. Well, was the legend true? Was it magnificent? What happened to you and your spear? Slow down, Irodotos. My spear's stronger now. I can feel it. You were right. There was some kind of artifact there. It showed me a vision of me and my mother. So, the ancient civilization is real. Cassandra, you have no idea the power you possess. All harnessed in Leonidas' spear. That's not everything. Demos followed me here. The cult's already moving, he told me himself. They're going after us. My family, Pericles. Why would he tell you? Unless it was a trap. It doesn't matter. We have to get to Athens to warn Pericles. And we need to find my mother before they do. Then, we go to the Penix. If Pericles is anywhere, he's there. A lot of this because all this is so amazing. Why did you write about it in your histories? Ooh, level up. I'm gonna get me. Do not hard her, but this looks pretty handy. Ready to embark! Ready when you are, Commander! going to stop it here and the next time uh, that I get on we're going to be vi giving Athens a visit and likely run into Pericles, maybe Cleon, maybe Nicias, a couple, couple of politicians so you all stay safe, stay healthy, stay awesome and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.